Next caller comes from the state of Missouri, and uh, Debbie, you're on the line with us. Your question for our Purina Mills panel, please. Well, thank you so much. Uh, my question is regarding a, uh, a mineral that I've been using for my poultry and my livestock called azomite, and I've been hearing that it's also good for antler uh, growth as well. Are you all familiar with this, and uh, what is your knowledge about using it in terms of uh, for deer? Okay, who gets that one, Gordon? Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not f familiar with that, um, but w what I will tell you is this, is that um, there's a lot of people that will feed a cattle mineral or dairy mineral to deer, and mm -hmm. deer are quite a bit different uh, from... Really? Yeah, you, you can tell. I mean, they're a little bit different. They look different. They look different. They, they look yeah. different, and, and in looking different, they also have unique uh, nutritional requirements and unique mineral requirements, and so... Uh, I'm not saying that the, that particular mineral won't um, help a deer, but if you want to really optimize the health of the deer, you need to feed a uh, mineral that's specifically designed for that deer. And, uh, you know, we have our, our Purina Mills deer mineral that is uh, specifically designed for deer using the, the research that Larry's developed over 30 years. Mm -hmm. And it's a little bit of weatherproof as well, so that if it's, it's, if it's put out, uh, it is a coarse mineral and it survives a lot of the, the, the moisture and the weather that uh, normally comes in the state of Missouri where uh, I'm from.